Hi, welcome back to ExchangeTimes.net. My name is Teens, and it's been a long time, but I've been busy playing with stuff, working, studying, waiting for my exam results. So, this video is all about installing PyQt4, PyQt4, however you want to pronounce it, on Linux. So, I've currently got Qt5 installed. Unfortunately, the book that I'm using uses PyQt4, so some stuff is not working in PyQt5 as per the book. So, I need to install Qt4 just to make it easier. So, I just want to show you how I do this. First up, I showed you I've got Qt5 installed. This is elementary OS. And, um, <clears throat> pardon me. Open the terminal, what you want to do, sudo apt update is always a good idea, just to update all your repositories, and making sure everything is synced or available. There we go. Paged, okay, come, you can do it. There we go. Okay, cool. <clears throat> Next thing I want to do is actually install Python 3 pyqt 4. So, sudo, sudo, I like saying sudo. Apt install Python 3 pyqt 4. I'll have all these commands in the description. It says I've already got PyQt4. Hmm, okay, so I must have installed this previously. No problem. And the next thing you want to do is install the libqt4 dev. So sudo apt install <coughs> libqt4 dev. Yes, we want to install that, please. While we're waiting for that, let's see if I've got idle installed. Yes, I've got idle. I'm going to use idle just to test that I can actually import modules from Qt4. Great. Now, what we want to do, the last step, is to install the Qt4, well, Python Qt4, <coughs> pardon me, Qt4 dev tools, and Python Qt4 dev and PyQt4 dev tools. So, this worked for me. Apt install. Once again, I will have these commands in the description for you. Do I have install the Python Qt4? Qt space Qt4 dev tools. Space Python dash Qt four dash dev and space by Qt four dash dev dash tools. Let's do all those goodies. One hundred sixty eight megs. So it's not too big. Let's wait for that to install. While we do that, let's check if we have Qt4 showing up yet. No, not yet. I think that actually <clears throat> will be installed with these last few binaries that we are installing. Uh, or packages, whatever you want to call that. Let's wait for it to finish and then you should have Qt4 installed. So let's have a look. I get Qt. And there we go, we've got Qt4. Want to open Qt4 Designer. Great. And there's our form. Booyah. Okay, great. So if you want to check, um, I'm just going to close this. So we open idle. I'm going to open idle with 3.6. Set uh, 3.6 is my base compiler in PyCharm. Import sys, or space sys. Enter. Sorry. <coughs> From PyQt for import 
QT go. Ooh, ta da! And we've got a working Pi Qt4. So now, ooh, wrong button. Now I can actually use Qt4 for my studies and Qt5 personally for myself. So following the book, Qt4 installed with Qt5. And following the book, I can do Qt4. Thanks for watching. Hope this is working for you. And hopefully it won't be too long till I have something to upload and blog about. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.